Anil Kumar Sen and in this tutorial you are going to learn about a new concept, new question and how to solve this type of problem in gate examination. Yes, the same question right now in front of you, this question already asked in gate previous year. That means if you will come to know how to solve this question, if this type of question will come in the next examination then probability again I am using that term I'm teaching you probability even okay then probability of solving that question will be much more right now let's go for this question what this question exactly asking us to find out so in this question what they said a box contains four red balls and six black balls so just underline these two things Three balls are chosen again. Three again, most important thing are chosen are randomly selected and uh, sorry selected randomly from the box one after another without replacement. This is another key factor, man. Probability that selected set contains one red ball and two black balls again. So this question is having lot of key points. I must say that. Well, let me share with you one thing. If you wanted to solve this type of problem, then you should know one concept that is combination. You know, using combination concept in case of probability becomes quite easier as well as quite simple and also time saving for solving the question. At least get a great point of view because you are going to get scientific online calculator that's why i'm sharing with you well previously we have used this calculator in gate examination but but nowadays what we are getting online calculator right so let's go for the question now what we have to do first basically we need to think like this what we have to do okay so we are choosing we're choosing what we are choosing two balls okay two types of balls right one is black ball and one is one is black ball and another one is what red balls so the probability of doing such thing is like this this, this is really simple just listen to me probability for this question we are choosing red ball first let's say and only one red ball the probability is saying total red balls are there four so four combination one we are choosing two black balls how many black balls are there six so six combination two now come to the nan point that is how many balls are we are choosing out of how many balls so their total balls are there are total balls are 10 and we are choosing three that means this is the this is it if anyhow you can do this then things become simple you just put the values on your calculator and get the right answer all right so okay, let's go for it 4c1 4c1 multiple 6c2 division 10c3 all right so how much value basically we are getting that is 0.5 now look at the option okay that is in reciprocal so we can write this as 1 by 2 you know that now option a is the right answer for this question as according to the answer we are getting so this is how we can solve number i mean we can solve mathematical problems related to probability it's really simple but you need to understand that it's a basic concept i mean it's base what is it right so thanks for watching. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Hope to see you again in my next video tutorial.